here we are. So here we are, uh, Barry and myself here. It's on my uh, 49th birthday. What greater way to celebrate than a hike up Tabletop Mountain, Toowoomba. But I'm doing a walk with the Brew Mission team uh, next Friday, so I thought I'd come and give it a trial. I haven't done it before. And I um, know what a great encourager and support Barry can be as well. So it's good to spend the birthday on the hike um, with a friend like Barry as well. So about to get into it, so we'll tune in again later. So here we are, we just completed kind of like the first five minutes of the uh, tabletop hike. As you can tell, I'm already out of breath. This is a steep climb, a bit of scrambling and rock climbing on the way up. It's a little bit slippery and wet at the moment after some rain, but not too bad. Um, we decided to have a stop and kind of show you the view from this point where we've stopped. And, um, the views all the way around on the way up are quite, well, quite, very nice. Especially with everything green at the moment, as compared to say about two or three months ago. But the, um, the grass is quite high on the way up as well. Selfie time. <laughs> And um, so, we'll keep going, we've had a quick sip of water, and um, we'll keep going. So the trail's flattened out a little bit here, I mean you still have your incline, but at least you have a trail now where before we were just pretty much rock climbing and scrambling up some rocks in that first five minutes. So it's been a good opportunity to get our breath back. You can see how, how tall the grass is around here, and some of the... It's basically a, a laneway that if it wasn't for walkers on the trail, I imagine we'd just get overgrown so quickly. But I'm really enjoying the walk so far. Yeah, pretty good, yourself. Yeah, right, that's good. Nice and steady. Yeah, <laughs> damn, that's for sure. Yeah. That's it. Sounds like you're only butt, mate. <laughs> I think so. Oh, <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> so, as you can see, it's quite a bit of a scramble, is probably not the right word, but you've got. All, all these rocks are loose rocks, nothing, you know, they, they're stable enough, but just be aware that they do move and it's easy to slip as well, especially if you've got a bit of mud on your boots and stuff. So you've got to, you've got to tread carefully and it goes probably for a good couple hundred metres at least um, through this kind of uh, ground. This movie got a bit of dirt now, a bit of wet ground, a bit slippery. Barry's opted for the for the rock scramble rather than the slip and slide. Well, here we are, we made it to the top. Um, the cool thing about it is there's a lot of different varying terrain. Uh, Barry and I were just talking about it there. When we bring the group here from school, the Peru Mission team, it's not a chance for anyone to really run ahead because the terrain will slow you down anyway with the variance of terrain that you have. It's a fair bit of scrambling, even rock climbing. Not the point where you're going to fall off a sheer cliff, but you know, it's still difficult. really works your calves and your quads. I found muscles in my feet I didn't know I had. Yeah, but it's a nice clearing up the top, the tabletop. It took us under an hour. So under an hour, so it's not a long hike, it's just a hard hike. Yeah, but you can pace yourself at it as well. 
And so even as the permission team comes up here next Friday, we'll um we'll do that. And um, we might even look at different group levels to come up and do it. Um, but uh, I know I've still got the way down to go, which really burns on your knees and your quads because it's so steep downhill. But uh, just thanks to Barry here for bringing me out and checking it out, going for a walk with me on my birthday. Uh, Happy, birthday. Happy birthday. Happy yeah, birthday, Jason. Th thanks, mate. <laughs> so here we are just on the downhill leg, maybe 100 metres or so, 200 metres of that last leg down to the car park. Just just through those trees there. I'll be able to see a slight outline. Well, there's some trees. Yeah, you can see some of the trucks down there. Uh, so I'll talk more at the bottom. But I don't how steep this is. It's ridiculous. So here we are. We finished. Uh, we're at the bottom of the tabletop mountain. How did you sum it up, Barry? Oh, it was good. I met a lot of people along the way. I thought it was cool we ran into some native Spanish speakers from Peru. And this whole thing was done because of that, and then to meet the people in Toowoomba yeah. on this hike from Peru, and you had the discussion with them, I thought that was cool. So um, God bless the Peru mission. It just looks like God's orchestrating things all over the place for this. Yeah, it's been a while since I've done a hike. I really like hiking. Um, yeah. So the, um, the idea that, that Barry put to me to come out for a practice hike before we bring the mission team out next week is um, kind of a blessing in itself. It's like, well, if I say no, I'm not a conviction of what I say, how I love hiking. Um, so I came out and so thanks for the encouragement, Barry. Um, There's a shot of the people from Peru we met along the way. And I think, from what I understood, you were able to let them know that we you were taking a mission to yeah. Peru. Yeah, let yeah. them know that we're taking a yeah. mission. They asked about how many and the school and where we're from and stuff. Yeah. Um, asked how long I've been learning Spanish and things. So it was good to have a conversation and put things into practice. And like Barry said, you know, the, the reason we're doing the hike is to prepare the team for Peru, and then to actually meet some Peruvians on the trail. Um, how do you think the mission team will go? How do you think the U10 and 11 students that we're taking will go oh, next man, Friday, Barry? It's going to be a mixed bag. I think that you, they want to stick together. I think I can imagine some people almost running up that. I can imagine people struggling along the way and wanting yeah. to turn back, perhaps. But I, I really pray that everyone can can make it up there and people can work together. Yeah. And uh, and they um yeah it'll be a really good uh, exercise for everybody. Yeah, I'm glad I came out. So like, yeah. the reason I came out wasn't just because I like a hike too, to be able to to look after the team properly yes. on the trail next week as well. We know, I know what to expect. And um, Carl, Carl and um, Miff have been up here too, so they'll be able to do that. Or should I say, Mr. Pumper, Mr. Shake, in case this goes on the Facebook page. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm looking forward to bringing the team out and um, testing ourselves and our um, team spirit next week. Yes. Okay. Thanks again, Barry. Awesome. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord.